Country music superstar Trisha Yearwood makes some mean deviled eggs, but what's her secret? How does she get them so perfect? Keep watching to find out. While deviled eggs originally started as a southern staple, they've since become a party favorite all over the world. These two-bite apps have been the stars of countless holiday parties, potluck dinners, picnics, game day gatherings, and any other occasion that calls for crowd-pleasing snacks that are easy on the budget and the clock. They're just about as versatile as you can get, too. Deviled egg recipes range from classic to out of the ordinary, with recipes offering everything from a spicy style with toppings like cilantro, smoked salmon, capers, and chili powder, to spicy shrimp remoulade deviled eggs with shrimp, spicy creole mustard, and ample garlic. In addition to being delicious, deviled eggs are also pretty easy to make. The basic recipe for these crowd pleasers is as easy as it gets. Hard boil some eggs, let them cool, peel and have them, remove the yolks, mix up some mayo, mustard, salt and pepper to add to the yolks, and then spoon or pipe away into the remaining hollowed out egg whites. The hardest part is avoiding the same pitfalls of hard boiled eggs, and from there it's just fun. Still, appearance also matters with deviled eggs. No one wants a stringy egg yolk or worse, one with that dreaded green hue. Fortunately, cookbook author Trisha Yearwood's family has been making these savory treats for years. Her grandmother handed down a few tips to achieve the perfect-looking appetizers, and Yearwood shared all the details with her audience. Yearwood has said that she likes her deviled eggs with mayonnaise, mustard, sweet relish, and of course, egg yolks, but when it comes to the musician's deviled eggs recipe, it's not so much what goes inside the cooked egg white as much as it is how the eggs are handled before they even encounter a pot of boiling water. Here's the secret to Yearwood's deviled eggs. Flip over your carton of eggs the night before you're planning to prepare them. This helps the yolk find its way to the center of the egg so you get an even distribution of white around the edge," she explains. When you get ready to boil them the next day, the yolk's right in the middle and they turn out perfectly every time. Eggs have traveled a long way before they make it to a spot in your refrigerator. It's likely the yolks have settled to the bottom. This tactic will help avoid a thick white on one end and a thin one on the other. Even the most delicious filling can be ruined by an egg that falls apart. Why did it all turn out like this for me? I had so much promise. Who would have thought, right? It's so simple, it's the sort of thing that makes everyone wonder why they weren't the ones to think of it. And that's not all. She has another tip, too, for taking some of the headache out of the worst part of making these delicious apps. She says, Really, really fresh eggs are harder to peel, so if you can buy your eggs and let them sit in the fridge for a couple of days before you boil them, they'll peel easier. And that is what we call food for thought. Yearwood also shared her insider tips for keeping the egg whites clean and neat, as well as her hack for preventing your egg yolks from developing that unsightly green rim around the outside. If you overcook your hard-boiled eggs, the yolk will have a green outer rim that will affect your deviled egg's appearance. Finally, once you've cooked your eggs, Yearwood advises keeping a wet towel handy to wipe down your knife as you slice each one in half. This will keep the egg white from becoming yucked up with yolk residue. Use all of these fairly straightforward and pretty easy little tips, and you'll have deviled eggs you'll be proud to take to any party or backyard barbecue. Oh, and in case you were wondering, Garth Brooks prefers more mustard than mayo in his deviled eggs, while Yearwood prefers hers with more mayo than mustard. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more mashed videos about all the best tips and tricks for the kitchen are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.